Frontier Markets Nigeria. I am Justina Okechuku here with a summary of how the markets performed at the close of trading. And the equities market closed the month of May on a bearish note as the NGX O share index fell further by 1.45% to close at 52,990.28 basis points. Now, looking at the top five gainers, Transco Hotel was up 6.84%. Champion Breweries was up 5.05%. Computer Warehouse Group also rose 5.05%. Echo Bank was up 5.04%. And Lasako rose 4.81%. For the top five losers, Nigerian Breweries was down 9.96%. Northern Nigeria Flower Mills was down 9.09%. Prestige Assurance fell 9.98%. And Multiverse Mining was down 4.76%. Meanwhile, NGS Group inched up 0.21% to close at 24 naira per unit, with a total of 44 deals traded in 8.019 million shares valued at 191.01 million naira. At the NESD OTC market, a total of 1.352 million shares valued at 17.818 million naira were traded. As the NSI declined 1.28% to close at 770 basis points. At the FMBQ Securities Exchange, a total of 6.795 billion naira worth of bonds, Nigerian Treasury bills, and OMO papers were traded on the platform. While the Central Bank Special Bills finished off with two deals worth 1.250 billion naira. At a discount high of 3.45% and a low of 3.45%. At the IE &E window, the Naira appreciated by 0.18% to trade at 419 Naira 50 cover per dollar, while open repo rates contracted by 317 basis points to settle at 9.67%. Now to markets news. Flower Mills of Nigeria full year 2022 revenue jumps 51% to 1.16 trillion Naira, while profit after tax rose to 28 billion Naira. First Bank of Nigeria Holdings holds its general meeting on June the 20th. McNichols Board of Directors meets June 9th to consider rights issue on the company's unissued shares. Ico Insurance declares gross dividend of 732 million naira. And that's all for you today on Frontier Markets Nigeria. Do join us again next time. I am Justina Okechuku. Bye for now.